so scary. I can't believe we're doing a video together. The My Gabby God, Show, guys. God. The Gabby Show. You have to check out our channel. It's hilarious. She tells funny stories from her life. I just gotta keep getting myself into really shitty situations so I can tell them. I always wonder with people who do story times. I'm like, what happens when like your life ends up just being normal and good? Like, um, well, hopefully that never happens to me. <laughs> well, hello guys, it's Lucas. Thank you for stopping by my channel. So I'm obsessed with her videos. Like I said, she tells stories. Basically, I'm kind of taking advantage of the fact that we're doing a video together and I'm gonna make you tell me more stories. I like that. We're actually gonna tell each other stories. It's pretty much two truths, one lie, but just it's one truth, one lie. If you guess wrong, there's gonna be consequences. What are they? Do we know yet? How about an Indian twist? <laughs> can either be an Indian twist or like a- We can do Indian twist. A wet twist. willy. Okay, and I kind of want your spit. I know, I like, I, when I said wet willy, I like started getting excited about getting one from you. <laughs> Fun fact, we were gonna do a thing where we put these weird slippers on that make your feet peel, and we were gonna peel off each other's skin feet and eat it, but... You thought we were gonna eat it. <laughs> anyway, enough about foot scrapings. Let's get on with the vid. I actually wrote mine down. Oh fuck, I didn't. Okay. Here are my two like mini facts slash stories. Okay. I was in an all boys dance posse growing up. And in okay. this dance posse, we once all wore halter tops and danced to bye bye bye. And it wasn't a joke. Next story is I lost my virginity in a Burger King break room. First story is truth, second story is a lie. How'd you know? Because you had so many details about it. You were just oh, like, shit. it wasn't a joke. Okay, I, yeah, I did not lose my virginity in a Burger King break room. Where'd you lose your virginity? Would you have been really sad for me if I did lose my virginity at a Burger King? Yes and no. It would have been so spontaneous and passionate that you can't even be mad about that. That's true, and we'd be able to eat Whoppers after. I was about to say... When I was a kid, I found my mom's sex toys, and oh I brought gosh. them to her and presented them to her because I wanted to play. And I also, when I was a kid, because my life is a joke, went to school and shit my pants, literally, in the lunchroom, and tried to pretend like I didn't, and put a lunch tray on my butt and pretended <gasps> like it was chocolate pudding. I feel like that's a lie. The chocolate tray, yeah. <laughs> I was following it until the lunch tray. Cause I was like, I, don't, I was like, I don't think Gabby would contaminate school property like that. <laughs> That's why. Wait, so you found your mom's sex toys? I wish I would have told that story. <laughs> Thumbs up for parent sex toys stories. Oh God. No wet willies yet, right? I know. We we know each other. I got in a freak motor scooter accident when I was 13. I got a cast because of it. Second story. I got kicked out of a water park for going in the women's restroom when I was a teenager. And it wasn't in a perverted way. I was just like hanging out there with Scooter friends. Scooter accident is a truth. <sighs> no. Nope. Damn it. I, I never have had a cast. Way. I always wanted one, but I never got a cast. Did you get in a scooter accident? No. But I did go into the women's restroom at the water park and get kicked out. I believe that. Sure. They kicked you out of the entire park? I think they were just worried that I was like a 13 year old boy trying to see tits. Wow, I just spit all over your legs. Are you mad at me? <laughs> Are you trying to distract me that I'm supposed to give you a wet willy right now? Wait, no. Do I get one? Yeah, because you lost. Oh, Do you pick wet willy or Indian twist? Wet willy. <laughs> I don't like the sound of you. <laughs> How far in there are you gonna go? I'll just do like a little one because you might lose more in the game. This is like losing my virginity. <laughs> oh my god. Sensitive ear <laughs> I just fingered Gabby. Okay, now I have to come up with one to stump you. When I was a kid, my dog died on Christmas morning. Not morning, it was actually Christmas Eve when I came home from church on Christmas Eve. And I literally out loud said, Not on Christmas! <laughs> <laughs> the other is... <laughs> Why did we laugh at that? That's actually a sad moment. <laughs> my other story is that I strangled a mouse to death. <laughs> oh my god, these both involve something Dead dying. <laughs> Dead animals. I kind of feel like the dog one's a lie. Because there was a lot of detail. It's a lie, but only because my dog wasn't dead. She was like really oh. sleeping and like wasn't moving. And I was like, not on Christmas. <laughs> but I did smother a mouse. It's one of the saddest moments of my life. It was not on purpose. So it was so tiny because it was such a little baby that it could get through its cages if I mm -hmm. didn't tape it. And that night I didn't tape it. So it escaped and it came in my bed and I slept on top of it and killed it. And I woke up and it was like, yeah, it was really sad. That happens to some people's human children. This is another one that involves virginity losing. I lost my virginity at or near a carnival. I once had to go to the hospital because of a food-related injury. That's true. 
That is true. It has to be true. I was like eight and I was trying to get like a bonbon off the top of our fridge. But I stacked two chairs on top of each other and it just tumbled down. I hit my chin. It wasn't a good time. A food related injury. Wow. Do you want to see the scar? Yeah. Oh my lord. Do you see it? Yeah. My ex-boyfriend once convinced me, or tried to convince me, to have an abortion when I was a virgin. <laughs> what? The other is, I dated a celebrity who also tried to convince me to have an abortion, even though there was no way I could have been pregnant. Oh my god, everyone thinks like you're trying to make them your, your baby daddy. I'm gonna say the celebrity one's true. Who's the celebrity? I can't tell you. Actually, I'll tell you later. Mind you, I had not had sex with either of these humans, so... <laughs> I once sang Beautiful Soul at a Talent Show and kind of killed it. And, um, <laughs> shit, now you know what the lie is because I can't think of it. I was like trying to think of a lie. Also, you said I kind of killed it. <laughs> well, whatever. I sang Beautiful Soul at a Talent Show and I did kill it, sort of thing. <gasps> Ew, I like oh scratched your ear. So, one time when I was in school, I did a talent show and I did a puppet show and I like sang with them and stuff. And the other is, I one time for a different talent show for my church, had to sing. It was really fucking embarrassing. I embarrassed myself in the entire parish. My godfather specifically, I remember looking at my godfather for whatever reason. <laughs> he and was he just, so ashamed. He was just looking at me like this. <laughs> I feel like that's a lie. They're both true. <laughs> oh my god, you I got, got me! You got me. You know why? You can give me an Indian twist to end the video. Thanks for having me. <laughs> we did a video for her channel, so go click the link below, check it out. Subscribe to Gabby, she's hilarious. She makes videos every Wednesday. And with that, I'm gonna dash out. What do we do now? We just pose. We have to pose oh. for like 15 seconds. <laughs>